need for a new hospital in the capital since the current hospital is the regional facility for the West. We have just had an evaluation done by by the Pan American Health Organization in terms of the safety and and um, of the hospital and the the uh, acceptability of the infrastructure and, 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 and really the unofficial recommendation for us is to is to see how we can build really a, a new hospital because on, we have a lot of leakage, we have a lot of inefficiencies in, in, in electricity, we have a lot of drainage that go under the hospital that um, were not supposed to be there. But at this point in time, we have a facility that that's, that's all we have. And, and, and we have to address, I mean, we have to try to see how we can make the best out of what we have at this point in time. Sir, in terms of the threat to the infant, we know that rats carry diseases, um, not only leptospirosis, other diseases as well. Has there been any testing yeah. done to determine if there was any transmission, if the infant might have gotten uh, infected? Well, um, the, the report I got today was that um, the, the, the baby seems to be, have been fine. Obviously, we have to have the baby under supervision and, and do some laboratory tests of course, to ensure that he's okay. But the, the baby is, seems at this point in time to be fine. Um, but, yeah. No, I was going to ask you if, if there is any concern, or is, maybe this is premature, but is there any concern about uh, liability uh, in terms of a legal sense? Uh, probably, I, I, I'm, I'm not sure. I... I, I, I <laughs> It would be it would be premature of me to say that that we, as I said, we, um, we spoke to the family, we explained to them the the, the problem, um, and we tried to do what we could to allay the fears of the of the family, um, to try to see what what immediate measures we can take to ensure that something like this doesn't happen again. Um, as I said, what they reported was that they, they were able to find a little hole around one of the vents where the rat might have come in, and that was sealed already today. Um, but the long-term the long term solution is really to look at the whole construction and infrastructure, and um, basically we had to build a new hospital, or, or basically we basically build a new hospital. The Senate met this morning in Belmopan following the House meeting on Wednesday, which was primarily convened for passage of the Electricity Acquisition Settlement Bill. The House approved $70 million to be paid to Fortis as compensation for BEL. The deal, which also includes 